Yeah, Hello. welcome. Howdy. Good morning and welcome. Today is the day to take action and see your life change forever. Let's do it. Yes. Um, welcome to our 21 day growth challenge where the purpose of this challenge is to encourage you to grow yourself mm-hmm. and grow your brand or your business or your dream or your nonprofit yeah. so that you can reach your goals. Because we know that just from experience, our own experience, from our clients seeing in their lives, our mentors, that if you focus on just one of those aspects, like let's say just growing your business or your brand, Mm. and you don't grow yourself in the process, you're going to hit limits. Mm -hmm. And same if you just focus on growing yourself, but not putting in the time to build your business, you're going to hit those limits as well. That's right. Yes. For sure. Keep going. So... Just to recap and yes. touch on the stuff that we've done, done. So day one and day two, every day we want to do it today as well. We're going to keep continuing to hit on this is start off the morning right. So set your morning in gear, in motion by quiet. If you can mm-hmm. silence everything, silence the madness, don't turn on your phone, go straight to quiet time, get in your you know favorite book, the Bible, pray, do some like mind preparation for the day, that's awesome. Because you're gonna have the, that clear mind is gonna change everything for the rest of it. Then get some exercise. Get outside, get dancing, move. He dances every morning to <laughs> Justin Timberlake. Just kidding. It's awesome. So um, I, I think I could take him out. If he had a dance oh, competition. Gosh. No, I don't know. Anyway, so then the, the, the next thing after exercise, uh, make sure to get into that period where you're building. So take some time to build on that passion, the dream, your favorite, you know, thing to do for for your business. You want to grow your business, take some time to build it. So that's the the recap of what we've been doing. We've been taking even if it's 5 minutes, right? And say you run short on time, all of a sudden, oh, well guess what? Tomorrow's a new day. You can add some time back. Make sure you, you're doing it because the whole purpose is after the 21 days, it's just a habit. It just becomes this normal thing. Yeah. So. And that's our challenge. So every day yes. we're just kind of recap those three things, encourage you in those three areas, and then at, and challenge you mm-hmm. to add a minute. So let's say you right. started with just one minute or like Mike said, five on day one. We're going to each day encourage you and challenge you mm-hmm. to add another minute. Yes. So just keep at, it's those small incremental um, additions and the, that daily, putting in that daily action. Right. Um, that's important. And even Sophia encouraged me, every day she goes out, she goes a little further, a little longer on the runs, taking a little more time, which is fine because when she comes back, it's, she's even more excited and more lit up for the rest of the stuff that's going to go out throughout the day. And it's just mm. more productive. It's I have awesome. my run hair. I have no makeup on. This is right after a run right um we want to be real and authentic and yeah. so we're coming to you real yes <laughs> sweaty <laughs> stinky sorry no it's all good and i want to say uh thanks melanie for hanging out yes. um hope we can cur- encourage you so um the adding one minute is huge yeah now we want to move on to making sure we ask you a question every day we have a question to kind of touch in on something that's the source uh, today is what do you stand for um, we always have this core thing about what we stand for and hold to those values um, because it keeps us focused. You stay on point and boom, you're continuing to move on that same standard regularly throughout your life, your business, your professional stuff, your friends and family time. It's always on that standard and it's we love this part about it. Yeah. So what is... What is it we call? So we have six things. We couldn't narrow it down to any less than six. <laughs> um, so we, uh, just to give you an example, so our number one thing is purpose. We mm. want to um, live life daily yes. with purpose, do our business with purpose. Mm. So purpose is extremely important to us. Yeah. The next thing is value, to value and respect everyone we come in contact with. Right. And Mike's a trooper and awesome, and he inspires me. He's really good at valuing and respecting everyone he comes in contact with. Um, Whether it's, you know, the barista or uh, the guy who does our yard, whoever, or it's a stranger on the street. He's just really awesome and respectful, and that's something that um, is very important to us. Mm -hmm. Um, Family, another thing, even in our business, that's one of our things we stand for because we don't want our business 
to take over our marriage no. or our family. Mm -hmm. So keeping that is something we stand for. Right. Adventure is the next one. We yes. love to take time to um, get out, get away. That's right. super important to just for us to clear our heads, to come together as a little tribe. Um, even small daily adventures, whether it's a run or a hike with some friends, mm -hmm. getting in that time is really important to us. Yes. Uh, the last two things are uh, lifelong growth. So always being a student, mm -hmm. always um, never thinking like we've arrived. We we no. know it all. It's no, it's about always growing. Yeah. And then the last thing is contribution, giving back. That's really important. We always want to be people who are not just taking in and learning and growing ourselves, but um, Gosh. pouring out to others as well. Yeah, there's so much satisfaction that comes through that. And that's the fact that, I mean, the fact of life is when you give, it's better, much better than to receive. You're always doing something, mm -hmm. and all of a sudden it settles in your heart like, whoa, huh? I feel purpose, I feel happy, yeah. it gives me the excitement to keep going, and also to see their results is huge. There's, their life has changed in some way for the positive because we put in time and giving. Oh, man, it's awesome. Yeah. It's awesome. A lot of joy. It, it is a lot of joy. Oh, and speaking of, we have yes. a little quote so out of um, Brandon Burchard's book. So, <laughs> we're pumping it. Really, I know, we, we're really pumping it. We're really not affiliates. We're really not no. making it. It's just a rad book. Yes. Um, have vision beyond your current circumstances. Mm. Imagine your best future self. So imagine that right now in your head, that best future self. What is that person doing? What do they act? What do they act like? How are they? Yeah. And start acting like that person today, right now. So instead yeah. of just like having that image in your head and like, oh, okay, that's one day I'll get there. One day I'll be that person. Mm -hmm. One day I'll get up you know, and not have to be stressed and rushing. One day I'll, mm -hmm. you know, start getting active again. No, it's like, let's start. Even if right little bits, let's start today. Right on. <laughs> and if oh, there wait. is, I was going to say too, if there's someone that you yes. see as a hero, there's, there's ultimately, we've always kind of kept that in the back of our minds of like, man, they're this incredible person and they've achieved so much. You know, one of my favorites is Martin Luther King. Guys that have done and made changes, incredible things and impacted not only community but the world mm -hmm. and world changes and that you're just like they're so huge they were so bold they were so strong they were courageous how am i supposed to ever get there well guess what it's possible we each day taking these actions want to keep mm -hmm. becoming better so that one day when it does that that opportunity comes which it will it's only a matter of time you're going to stand up and do something you're going to make a difference and so the question i was going to say to go back to is who's your hero who's Who's someone you look up to and say, they're awesome, they're amazing. I would, I would be amped to like, meet them or be like them. Well, is there someone that you guys are you know, looking up to? And just post it, put it in the comments. Yeah, cool. awesome. And also, even if you want to write what you stand for, what oh, are, yeah. what's one thing or a few things that you stand right. for? We'd love to hear that that's as gonna, well. Yeah, that's going to um, light us up. And then <laughs> one last quote from this book, which is, only put off until tomorrow what you're willing to die having left undone. That's from Pablo Picasso. So he puts it pretty harsh. He lays it on the line. Um, he's like, okay, only put off what you're willing to have to die left undone, like having left undone wow. and not doing. So get at it. Take some action. 60 seconds, five minutes. Get at it. Start making these things a habit yes. and your life will um, change. Forever. Cars has. <laughs> So, right yep. on. Shock, have a great day. Adios. Bye. Bye.